Hey guys, it is Oi oh, is here back again today. I'm gonna be jumping straight into a FIFA 13 squad builder. Um, but I haven't really, I know I really haven't done this in quite a long time, or one of these in quite a long time. But um, today I'm gonna be going with my gold Brazilian team. Uh, the formation is 4-3-3, and uh, the price is around 250, or I'd say about 300k, so or 300 to 350k. So um, starting off, we're just gonna add our manager, and he's gonna be. El Bosque. Um, starting off at in goal, uh, we're gonna have Diego Alves. Now, um, I bought him for five thousand five hundred coins. Uh, if you look at his stats, they're pretty impressive. Uh, but I know his hand thing lets him down a little bit, but I really don't mind to be honest. Uh, just because I think still think he's a brilliant goalkeeper and one of the best uh, Brazilian goalkeepers in my opinion. If you guys know any other goalkeepers, then let me know. Um, but going at left centre back, we're gonna have Dede, the beast Dede. He's been on Manchester United's uh, transfers for quite some time now. I know they've wanted to buy him. I got him for about five thousand coins, as you can see there. And uh, his pace is brilliant for a centre back, and uh, his defence is also eighty-one. So I find those stats—they're the kind of stats that I look for when I look for a decent defender. And I found Dede, and so I already know he's really good. So I decided to pick him. Right centre back, we're gonna go and we're gonna have Felipe Santana, also 81 pace, 77 defending, still isn't that bad, but um, two solid centre backs there, and they're both really, really tall. So if you whip in a um a cross uh, from a corner, they're most likely to get their head on it and score you a couple of goals. I bought him for 2,500 coins. Uh, moving on to right back, we've got Raphael. I was going to get Mike on, but I thought uh, maybe not, uh, just because he pushes up a lot. So that he, I guess he'd be more for a formation where you have like right wing backs and left wing backs, because I know he pushes up a lot. So I think I was thinking about it. As you can see, I have the money to buy it. I don't know why, but um, I accidentally sold um, quick sold Alexander Pato. Um, by accident, so I had to go back and buy him again. I had like a hundred and two thousand coins, but uh, here we have Raphael. I actually got him in a pack. I'm not really sure how much he goes. I don't think it's that much, but he still has 84 pace and 76 defending, which is pretty decent for um, this squad and um, pretty decent squads for a right back. Uh, left back, we're gonna have Marcelo. I bought him for about four forty four thousand coins. Sorry, uh, he's got 83 pace and 83 dribbling, which is pretty surprising for a um, left back of his. Uh, stature, but I still think that's really good, especially when like he comes up field uh, to try and help with the attack because you need people who can dribble with the ball. He also has eight defending, which is really good as well. So I think he's a pretty decent all-round player. Um, let me know what you guys think. Um, centre mid, the first centre mid uh, we're gonna have is gonna be uh, Hernandez. Yeah, I put Hernandez there. Uh, he's his shot power, guys, is absolutely wicked. I mean. If you have time and space, and um, just take a shot. I'm pretty sure it will be on target and it will probably go in. His shot power is epic. I mean, he's got 5-star weak foot, 4-star skill moves, and he only costs about 10, 11k. So I think he's a really decent deal to go out and get, a really decent player to go and buy. Uh, the next centre mid we're going to have is going to be Lucas, who recently transferred to PSG. Uh, he's got 92 pace and 88 dribbling. Um... I mean, also his shot, it says 77, but that's pretty close to the 80s. I mean, his shot's still wicked as well. You could probably hit a couple of long shots with him too. Uh, I got him for about 20k, but this is only because uh, I know his price is obviously going to go up. Just because uh, he's um, he's transferred to PSG. But uh, it doesn't really matter, in my opinion, which um, version you get. I think they are the same ratings. Uh, let me know if you guys know the answer to that question if um, the stats are the same as his old card from uh, Sao Paulo in the Brazilian league um, the last centre back, centre back, centre mid we're going with sorry is uh, Ramirez, I know I could put Kaka on but I haven't really experimented with him I guess you could put him on but um, for now I'm just going to have him on the bench because I haven't really tried him that much but um, I bought uh, Ramirez for 8,600 coins um, 88 pace, 76 defending and 82 dribbling I mean, they're pretty solid stats for a centre mid, and I think he's one of those underpowered people. I mean, he's a really decent player, and he can get a pretty good shot off as well. It says only 68 shot, but to be honest, it's a lot better than that. Um, now, we're going to go to the beastly forwards, uh, left wing, you know we're going to have Neymar, 
and this guy is epic I mean take a long shot with him you'll probably see the clips at the end I'm probably gonna put a couple of clips together I took a couple of long shots with Neymar just having a test um, and they hit the post and I was there literally going oh like screaming at my TV and I was like how did that hit the post I was so surprised when it hit it, but I've actually scored a, a long shot uh, from more or less the halfway line against my friend. Uh, it was an epic, epic goal, and I was screaming like crazy for about five minutes. I just couldn't get over it. It was probably like the longest long shot I've ever scored. But uh, yeah, I bought him for 108,000. Um, that was a really good deal going on, and it just happened to be in my formation. Uh, usually, he'd cost about, I'd say, 120k. I'm not sure on Xbox, that is. I'm not really sure the price of PS3, but uh, he's got 5 star skill moves and 4 star weak foot, so also he's got 91 pace and 91 dribbling, so you guys got to get those long shots, got to get those skills going if you love skills. Um, striker, we're going to have Alexandra Pato, yep, he's finally here this time, I didn't quick sell him, but yeah, he's another really good attacker, I mean, he's got decent pace, 89 pace, 83 dribbling, 78 shot, I mean, you'll see in the clips, I'll probably try and include the clip if I can find it, I took a wicked long shot with him and it actually went in, or it's a fairly long shot uh, from pretty far out the field, and it actually went in, and his shot power is really good, and if you get a sweet connection with him, um, you know, it's probably going to go in, I got him for around 7,000 coins, you guys can probably pick him up for less, just because of the formation I've got him in, um, next, or last but not least on the starting 11 we have the beast hulk now isn't he's another beast i mean he's really strong he's got 85 shot there as you can see if you take a long shot with him on his left side boy the shot power is absolutely epic i mean for some reason he only has two star weak foot but i managed to score a long shot not a long shot a volley with him with his right foot and it went underneath the keeper which was okay but uh, I think they nicknamed him Hulk because he's a beast, he's fucking scary. If I saw him in real life, I'd probably shit myself. But yeah, anyways, 90 pace and 82 dribbling. Uh, got him for about 8,500 coins. Um, once again, another decent attacker. And if you need pace and good shot and strength and things like that, he's definitely the player you should get, especially if you're thinking about making a Brazilian team. Um, but yeah, on the bench, we're going to have um, Kaká. Nene, all those people, but um, once again, I mean, I know this uh, team doesn't have the likes of Thiago Silva just because his price has gone up a little bit, and I'm probably just going to wait till his price goes down again uh, just until I decide to buy him. But um, yeah, I mean, he's gone back up to like 160k now, which um, before I sold him for like what 105 just because of the market crash, I didn't, I really didn't realize that um, the prices were going to go back up and go back up to more than what the players are actually worth, which I was pretty surprised about, but um, yeah, you guys are going to see some gameplay now, so I hope you guys like this video, if you guys enjoyed this squad builder, uh, don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already um, and you want to see more, um, I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay, uh, this team cost about uh, 300, uh, not 300, 200 to 250,000 coins, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and the squad. Now, on to the clips. I will see you guys later. This has been Iron Magics, and I'll see you guys later.